Hey everyone, today we're taking a look at the Empire EVS, which is this mask. And they have a lot of really nice features, so we thought we'd show you about them. Um, to start off, this is a mask with a bit of a wider profile, so like, if you have a bigger head, this is probably going to fit you better than some of the smaller masks. Uh, it's definitely a, a, covers a little bit more compared to something like an i4 or a Virtue Vio or whatever. Um, and it also comes with a lot of like, you know, nice quality of life features. Um, simple things, nothing revolutionary, stuff like a rubberized strap so it fits on your head real nice. Um, the foam change, the, if you have to change the foam, the foam is both like pretty nice. It's got like three different layers of foam there. They're all kind of different. And it's actually attached to one of the, to a plastic frame. So basically if you do have to change your foam, you don't have to glue anything. You just pop the old one out and pop the new one in, which is very, very nice. If you've ever had to re-glue in a foam, like a replacement foam, it's annoying. It's like, you don't want to have to do that. It's easier to just pop something plastic in. So that's cool. Um, it does have this nice little soft cushiony pad on the chin strap. It is removable. If it annoys you, you can take that off. But I thought it was a nice touch. And it has arguably one of the easiest lens change systems ever. Like it's really, really easy. I am gonna show you how it works, although I almost guarantee that you don't need me to. Like it's, it's pretty easy to just look at it and figure it out, but you know, I'm gonna show you anyway. So let's just jump into that. So on either side, you're gonna see a little arm that says pull arm on it. You wanna pull that arm and then you're gonna rotate it until that red piece stops rotating. And then of course, you're just gonna do it to the other side. Uh, very, very easy. There is a little indicator on there showing you which way to rotate it to lock it and to unlock it. Um, so yeah, you should be able to figure it out. Once those are in, are, have been rotated into place, all you wanna do is just gently push on the inside of the lens. I like to push on the sides, that way I'm not putting fingerprints right in my field of view. And then you're just gonna slowly work it out until you can get a grip on the edge and just kind of work it out like that. And that's it, you cut your lens out. Um, very, very easy, very, very quick. Obviously to put it back, you're just gonna feed it back into place. I find wiggling it helps a little bit. You just wanna make sure that the little teeth on the top and the bottom of the lens go into their respective holes. Once that feels like it's in place and not going anywhere, all the edges are flush. You're just gonna pull on the arm again and rotate it back into place. And as soon as it stops rotating, it's where it needs to be. Push the arms back in and you're done. That's it. It's like one of the quickest lens changes ever. So yeah, there you have it. That is the Empire EVS. So if you're in the market for like a mask that's a little bit bigger, it's gonna cover a little bit more of your head but not sacrifice like, like field of view, this is a really good choice. Like you can see a lot in this mask. It's got this big, huge lens. So nothing's cutting off your vision and it's still, you know, protecting your face if you have a bigger than normal face. So if you're looking for a mask like that, I definitely recommend you check it out. It's like, it's, it's pretty nice, I like it. Um, but what do you guys think? Those of you that use an EVS, like, do you like it? Do you have complaints? Would you like to see something change? Let us know in the comments and thanks for watching.